Hello everybody, welcome back to more Slay the Spire. Let's play the defect character. The final of the three characters. Oh. Enemies in your next three combats have one HP or max HP seven. What I I mean, I never really have issues on the first first floor, or whatever you want to call it. So why would we I guess we don't really need to focus on that, do we? Well, anyways, alright. And it's the slime boss. I I feel like we should be pretty dang good at, at getting to the final or the final fight of this floor. I'm not too worried about it. I've been told it's a good idea to take a lot of fights with little enemies. I don't know if this is true. I don't know. I, I don't know how much of it is it's something I should just blindly follow, but you know what? I'm, I'm feeling like... Let's go up this way. It seems like a good mix of question marks. Or we could even go to the shop. We could remove one of our uh, starting cards. So anyways, this guy is wonky. He's real wonky. He has a bunch of orbs. Or he can have a bunch of orbs that do things at the end of your turn here. So we got a passive. So at the end of the turn, this is going to deal three damage. Every time I play an orb, it shifts them to the left. If it gets shifted off the side, it does the evoke. So it does three damage. But if I have three slots, for example, if I had three lightning orbs and then I played a fourth, it would push this one out to out and evoke it and then uh the one right here would be the passive one i, I don't know what did i did that make sense yeah okay evoke your next orb twice so this would just immediately evoke it twice i don't think i want to do that even though it deals 16 damage because we kind of want to save that for a little bit let's just do the six damage for now we'll just we'll punch him with our elbow it sort of looks like it's just an elbow punch? Kind of weird. But, alright, so we'll channel another orb there. Bada bing, bada boom. If we can evoke it now, that should do it. Easy peasy. Anyways, I really, really like this guy. I don't know how to play him correctly. Deal 10 damage to all enemies and channel in dark. Increase damage every turn when evoked. Oops. Deals damage to the enemy with the least HP. Two two mana, ten damage AOE, and channel a dark. Or we could channel a random orb. What's the upgrade? Channel two random orbs. I'm not sure that I love the idea of it being random. But the thing is, it could be one of the energy orbs, which give you an extra an extra mana essentially to work with I'll, I'll just i'll do it i'll do it i'll see move a card from your deck lose seven hp easy oh oh okay we do i was like do we not get a picket that would have been really awful let's get rid of a strike and then let's you know what should we just blindly get rid of a of a defense deal seven damage draw a card for each unique orb you have you know what that mixed with the wild is kind of good. The wild random. Gain two orb slots. Oh. Oh, never mind. I want that. And it's a power, so it doesn't really take up that much deck space. All right, I'm thinking. Okay, so it actually pushes it off to the right, I guess. Doesn't really matter. Evoke your next orb twice. I mean, it says the rightmost. Yeah, the rightmost. So that'd be this one. We could potentially bop somebody, but I think I'm just going to go with the... Uh, we'll just build ourselves up for the next turn. We should be able to bop him this time. This time for sure. Or not. fine doesn't really matter if we block all the damage for that turn it, it like really doesn't matter okay man man so the frost one is two block and if you evoke it you gain five block unnecessary but fun all right auto shields if you have no block gain 11 block 
Gain seven block, channel two frost. Double your energy and exhaust. That seems great. Like, that just seems like a no-brainer great thing to have. Lose three HP for a 25% chance to find a relic? Sure. Cool. Whenever you climb a floor, gain 12 gold. No longer works when you spend any gold at a shop. That seems really, like, not that good. 12 gold, that's it? When you climb a floor? Oh, that's, a, that's climbing a floor. Holy crap. Okay, that, that immediately makes it great. Okay, I get it now. Seems like a pretty good idea to just make that like a no-brainer boy. Make that zero mana, that's pretty good too. Gain three orb slots. I mean, that sounds fun. I, I, I'm into a lot of this. I think I'm gonna go with this chaos though. Channel two orbs, two random orbs. Okay, so now that I know that all of these are a floor, that's pretty wild. I mean, if we're gonna fight an elite, I'd rather fight it first. I hate this guy. But it should be fine. Draw three cards. So every time we play a skill, he gains two strength. Oi, oi, oi. Passive for the start of turn, gain an energy. Yep, yep, yep. Seems good. So you're saying we have to choose now between blocking and... Oh, man. Oh, man. I think we might have... Maybe should have just taken that hit. Should we try... to... double our energy? Evoke your next one twice. Chaos. That would make it do eight damage. And then we'd spawn another thing. We do one, two, three, six, nine. Ah, math! 17. There's no way we would we wouldn't kill him, right? Like even if we got double cast and we draw 16. I don't think we would kill him. I'm going to play this though, and I'm going to strike. And I think I will still defend. Like I think that that's that's fine. That's a fine amount, because I think we can kill now. I think. Oh, I don't like what I've done. 16. And then another eight, 24. Then there'd be three. Oh my god. The math on this one is really is really hitting me. Do I need to bring out my freaking calculator? Okay, so we if we evoke twice, it'd be 16. Then we zap, it'd be 8. So and then we would have we would evoke both of those. We would only have what? One lightning? So that'd be an additional three. It would put us at 27. We'd need to deal. Okay, the math checks out. The math checks out. The math does not check out because I did it in the wrong order! What a dumb man I am. The math does not check out because I should have done that in the reverse order. Should have evoked the lightning, or channeled the lightning, and then evoked the lightning. I missed out on eight damage. Oh, I'm so stupid. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. That shouldn't have worked. <laughs> uh, lightning hits two all enemies. Channel two lightning. Dang, dude. Channel energy. What's the upgrade of this? Cost one to channel a plasma? That seems like 
ridiculous. That seems ridiculous. If we can upgrade that? God, I can't. Just, let's skip the merchant. We want to just keep building our money for now. Start the combat with the dexterity. I'm not going to fight that for one dang second. I think we can handle two basic fights. I just want to upgrade this really bad after I saw that. That just seems like such a good idea. Take the golden idol to trigger a trap. Curse with an injury, six max HP. Let's do six max HP. Maybe stupid. God, I'm, am I gonna really do this to myself? I'm, I'm just like, I, I can't believe how wild I'm being, but I just, I feel like being frisky. What can I say? Can you blame me? It's so fun to play fast and loose. All right, so we can dual cast. We can double our energy. And uh, that provides no value to us. <laughs> oh, my God. Don't leave. Don't leave. Guys, <laughs> hold on. I promise I'll, I'll get my act together. This just is fun. I like, I just love this character. As well. All right. Static discard. Just, just discard. Whenever you receive attack damage, channel of lightning. Uh, sounds nice. Cost one less for each power card played this combat. We only have one. Whenever you play a power card, draw one card. We only have one. I'll do it. I don't know. It's a power card. I feel like we can get away with it. Well, at least we're going to evoke two lightning with our stupid hits we got here because we have no freaking defense drawn there. So we might as well do that. Okay, that gives us defend. That's nice. We'll block both of them. I know we could uh, use a little bit of our frost here and be fine. But we need to, like, get good. We could have, tr like, hoped that we would hit him with the lightning, but this way we're just... We're fine. We're fine. All right. Streamline. Deal 15 damage. Reduce this card's cost by one. What? Streamline. Deal 15 damage. Reduce this card's cost by one. Uh, that seems, like, really good. This seems good, too. Oh, oh, no, I didn't. I wanted to look at it. Uh, it's okay. This seems good, too. Because you just start with... The, the downside is that um, it always takes up part of your starting hand. That, that it, It's a bummer. Like That's not great. Especially because I don't know that a lot of them even do it. But you don't have to use it right away. This is a pretty... Boring hand. Gain one focus. Gain four focus. The starting room. Oh. Focus increases the power of your. Okay, okay. Power of your orbs. Let's do that. Let's play that right away. Why not? Alright. So we still have the boot sequence in our deck. It's not like it's gone bad. Is he gonna split? Already? That is annoying. I forgot. He splits right away. I mean, there's not much we could have done. Oh, he's not. He's angry. He's real mad. We need to deal an insane amount of damage to him. 
don't we, to get him to split, like, 50? Like, that's not happening. We could channel two random orbs. Or we could gain two orbs. I don't know. Do we want to do this first, or... That's a lot of energy. I mean, there's nothing we can do. We can't defend. Like, I was really hoping we would get some, uh... Oh, my God. I was really hoping. Oh, boy. And now we got all our defense. Now we got all our defense? Sir! Stop it! Why'd we get them all now? Just split, man. Split. But now they got so much health. We just, we have too much defense in our deck. I want to get rid of the plasmas. Why are we getting all the plasmas? Oh, I'm going to lose my marbles. I'm going to lose my marbles. Channel one plasma. No, thank you. I mean, I guess we might as well now. Just like we, we have... Great ways to... Oh, we're dead, man. We're so dead. We're so dead! You kidding me? What a garbage deck we built. No, like... Do we have... We just... We got all our defense at the wrong time? Why was our deck so bad? Like, why was it so bad? Honestly, it's, I don't think that the randomness really helped us at all. I mean, let's do... Obviously, we're gonna run it back. We're gonna not let that be it. Ooh. But, uh... I don't know. I guess... Yeah, the randomness kind of didn't do us well. Like, we... Like I said, we probably shouldn't have gone for that. Max HP 7. Remove a card from your deck. At the start of each combat, channel one lightning. We could lose that. I don't think I want to. I mean, I think we got, like, I th that last run, it was a mixture of a stupidly built deck and bad RNG at the same time. Like, we we got all defend cards on, time, on turns where we needed all attack, and we got all attack on turns where we got all defend. Like, it was just a mixture of stupidity. I was so confident we were going to beat that first floor, which is hilarious. Like, I've, I don't know that I've ever lost that fight against that slime before. But we just, we couldn't kill him fast enough. We couldn't get him to the split fast enough. And that's, a uh, it wrecked us. Add a random power card to your hand. It costs zero this turn. That sounds kind of fun. Deal seven damage, channel one lightning. That sounds probably better. Like, let's stick with something a little bit more traditional for a moment here. Just damage and lightning. Like, let's get rid of our strikes and put in that other thing. Can we... Good deal. Dead man. It's going so fast now. Rebound. Deal nine damage, put the next card you play this turn on the top of your draw pile. Oh, that sounds so fun. That sounds really fun. You walk by an eerie statue holding up several masks. Something behind you softly whispers. Stop. You swerve around to face the statue, which is now facing you on closer inspection. It's not a statue, but a statuesque, gaunt man, even breathing. Face... Let me touch. Maybe trade. Lose 7 HP. 50% good face, 50% bad face? What on earth? For me? For me? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Mm, you see one of his arms flicker and your face is in its hand? Your face has been swapped. Nice face, nice face. 
feel more talkative. What? What just happened? Hmm. Seven block next turn gain energy. That's I mean, like let's just go with that. Let's just go with good value cards, like things that just seem basic but pretty good. Like ball lightning seems great. Even so, like let's just do that. Let's rebound that so we can know we have a dang thing to block this turn and we didn't even need it. It's fine. Just happy knowing that it was an option. But yeah, I'd like to I'd really like to get rid of the zap too, honestly. Oh wait. Could we No, that'd be one one too few. I'd rather just let's play it safe. Yeah you're yeah, here. Put one card from your draw pile into your hand. That seems really good, too. What's the uh, upgrade? Put two cards. Sure. Let's let's just do that. Let's play... Uh, we're going to play a blue Magic the Gathering deck. Uh-oh. Kaka. Uh, okay. Like, for example... Add a card to your hand. Wait. Yeah, we want to. Let's do rebound. So we can do this, that. Oh, he's already mad. Oh, that's fine. Aren't we all? Gotta defend that, boy. Oh, wait. We still have an extra energy. I like this. This, this deck seems not so bad. Like, I feel like we're doing okay. We're dealing nine damage every turn, even if we block... So it's not the worst. Honestly, maybe I should have waited to do rebound last because I don't really want to draw a strike. Do want to draw a block. Eight. Nine. There's the eight. Ah, man! You son of a gun! Alright, fine. We weren't going to be able to finish him off. There we go. Get out of here, sucker. The boot. Whenever you would deal four or less unblocked damage, increase it to five. Including the lightning? That seems like it could be really good. I want streamline. I want it. I want it. It just seems like it could be so good. Do we want more than one streamline then? Do you want more than one? Deal six damage, channel of frost. I mean, that seems really good too. Channel of frost, draw a card. If we're doing streamline, we want a thin deck. But maybe if we have two two streamlines that would be fine oh there's another bonfire let's just let's smith now upgrade two random attacks hey nice and let's just be a good boy let's heal heal before this next little boss. I hate this man. Okay, at least we get charge battery is, instead of another wasteful defend. I'm going to go for an all-out attack here. And I'm just going to leave it. I'm going to leave it at that. Because I think we can probably kill him this turn with the right stuff. Dual cast, so that'd be 16. Bada bing, bada boom. That was so satisfying. 
Rebound plus, it just, rebound plus streamline seems so good. I shouldn't have done that. Like, we're not, we shouldn't. Should we take 13 damage just because it'd be fun to see if this, I want to do this because I want to figure out, why does it say we can play that? So is it going to be, is it going to cost one? Oh, baby. That's a deck. Let's just, no, we want to. We want a nice slender deck now. Should we fight the elite? This is unwise. I made a bad choice. I feel like I made a bad choice, but you know what? It's okay. I actually really want to draw. Good deal. So now we're going to get a free streamline. That's wild. Seven plus six, 13. That's not enough. But we can play everything we have in our hand anyways. Bite me, Lagavulin. You're nothing. Max HP up by 10. Keep rebounding. That just seems great. Gremlin is madly shuffling cards on the table. Monster seems to be a harmless one. You approach him out of curiosity. Twelve cards. Match them to keep them. Five tries, no do-overs. Are you ready? Let's start. Okay. We'll, we'll see if we even want them. Okay, so we know what that is. I don't think I want Swift Strike. Alright. Yeah, like, I, I don't know that I necessarily wanted those. So, I, that's why I was being intentionally kind of bad, because none of them looked that enticing. All right, good deal. Oh, my goodness. I love this deck so much. Give me another rebound. Holy crap. What have I done? Why did I not defend? It's because I'm getting greedy with that streamline. Alright. You gotta be careful here. Charge battery, great. Streamline, great. Five times two, hey, might as well block. Good. All right, I think I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be fine. He's gonna take a little bit to charge up again. All right, more than happy to take one uh, one damage. Oh no, not even. Oh, this is juicy. Oh my god, that next turn would have been nasty. Do you have 10 damage, put all zero cost cards from your discard pile into your hand? Does that work how I think it does? Gain an energy, but all enemies start with one strength. Gain an energy, but you can no longer rest? Gain energy, but you can no longer smith. I definitely, I mean, I want one of these. Strength. No longer smith. I don't know. It seems like that might be a good idea. It's just one strength. It could add up, though. It could be awful. I know. We can do 12. But, I mean, we might as well do... 
do that, right? We're gonna take quite a bit of damage, but... So then, could we do something like, just for the hell of it? Would that make us draw? Okay, ah, I wanted to figure it out. The end of combat heal and HP, or seven HP. Seems good. I kind of want. I, I like the idea of the charge battery too, like, and removing some of our strikes here. Hmm. Mayhem. That sounds fun. I don't want to do it, but that's that sounds like it could be a lot of fun just playing a random card. Let's just get rid of our strikes. They're garbage. They're garbage. Receive five apparition. Ethereal gain one intangible exhaust. That's... I... This deeply reminds me of Hollow Knight. I don't think... That's something I want to mess with at this point. How disappointing you'll join us sooner or later. Ha! Alright. Kaka. Why do we kaka? Like, what, what? what's so good about it? Like, <laughs> am I crazy? I just feel like I'm missing something there. Probably should have not gone for what I just did. That was so dumb. Like I need to, I need to start. It's a good thing I'm getting rid of my strikes, but I gotta start like not playing so stupid. Cause two times five doesn't look like a lot over there, but it's a lot. It's a lot. So that's eight. Heal six. So we can evoke our next orb twice. Does that? Oh, it does the full eight. I was just curious. Yeah, we've done something dumb. We gotta definitely rest at the bonfire next time. The game's forcing me to be uh, intelligent with <laughs> blocking here. Somebody stop him. It works how he thought. Do we need another rebound? I feel like we have enough. We have two. No, we have three. I think three is plenty. All right. Moving fast and loose here. Okay. Not a huge fan of this guy. Should have definitely gone for the defend. Like that's the stupid thing is I I, or I should be going for charge battery. It's just so fun to see the big numbers. It's just so fun to see big numbers. All right, there we go. Next turn will be... See, there we go. That's being wise. We're setting ourselves up for later. We only take eight damage. Okay. Should be completely fine this turn. See, look what, look what being patient did. Like, as soon as we got patient, our run got so much smarter. 
There's no shop I can go to to remove a card. We have two charge batteries. Let's let's get three charge batteries. I want to remove, but still. I right, thank goodness. It let's us do this smartly. Do this in a way that's not so stupid. Okay. Uh, I hate this. That should still reduce, right? Okay. At least we have streamline against this guy. Oh my god. This is awful. So every time we draw it, it's randomized. Oh, here we go. Or every time it gets put in our draw pile, it's randomized, I guess. Another streamline? Or another all for one. There we go. I like that idea better. The first time you lose HP in combat, draw three cards. That sounds really fun. Oh my god, we're so... So in such a, which is, I'm not feeling it. I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna get bopped at this point. Okay. Two on the same guy. Ah! I was hoping for like a miracle. We should be able to bop him next turn. Without much trouble. There we go. Let's just play it safe. We need to we need to be really careful with our freaking health. Ow, he's gonna hit hard. Yeah, that's... I don't know. I'm not feeling good about this anymore. Okay, well, we're gonna block all that. We got our energy for later. Whatever, let's just... Guarantee we draw a defend. We have to be able to kill, right? Yeah. Easy. All right. I'm not feeling very confident, though. Unless we get to... Oh, uh, we're dead. We're dead. We're dead. We're dead. Kaka! Definitely throw out a streamline, because why not? We die. Unless... No. Nine? Fifteen? So here comes, so we can poison him. I don't know if, when this armor goes away. Six. Oh! My heart. My heart. Alright. Alright, please have a way to heal me! 
up upgrade all strikes and defense. How many defense do we even have? Upgrade them all to eight. I, I mean, that might be fine. Or we could, like, remove Zap. I'm gonna... I'm gonna do it. Like, I, I think that upgrading all of them will help us out quite a bit. Oh, shucks. Probably shouldn't have done that, like, now. But I just... I, I'm in fully prepared for a rough go of it. Should we rebound? I'm thinking rebound charge battery. Or no. Should we streamline? I feel like I should have looked at my board first. We have a lot of energy. We have one, two, three, four, five. I think we can play streamline. And it'll be fine. Do we have any zero-cost cards yet? No. So I'm thinking, let's see. 14, 21. Could we, can, I'm just thinking, what are the odds that he would die? I think they're pretty, they're pretty low. Yeah, he didn't even get hit once. Definitely gonna charge battery something here. We're just charge battery, but I'm just thinking, should we rebound and charge battery? Oh, if we had a zero cost streamline already, that'd be amazing. I mean, we want to, we, we need this guy to die, but I'm just trying to think, is there some cheeky way we can get him? Like, rebound. No, we can't, but we can't rely on a lightning hitting him. That's just like, the odds of that are so slim. Coming, ouch. Alright. Do we lose? I don't think so. But this is definitely an ouch moment. I'm, I'm talking about the whole fight. Like, this was this was awful. I'm loving the charge batteries, though, let me tell you. I kind of like keeping our deck sort of trim. No! Why did it have to be a fight? Oh, why did it have to be a fight? To bop this fool like pronto. We need to bop this fool like yesterday. Uh, that sucks. Big defend. Here comes a big smacking. What? What? No defense. They're all right here. They're all right here. Oh my god. 
Dang, damn it. I'm so peeped. I'm gonna at least kill your freaking friend. So you have nobody with you after I go. All right. That sucks. That deck was looking real good to an extent. I mean, I don't know anything about deck tier list or anything. Once again, let me re reiterate. I'm not doing another run. If you're here for, like, somebody who knows what they're doing, you've come to the wrong place. I must tell you. I, this, this is a series for learning. I, I don't have thousands of hours in the game. I've, I've got, like, I don't know, like, or something and it's scattered across a couple of years so i'm gonna i'm definitely in the learning phase at this point so anybody who has like helpful helpful pointers please throw them at me i'm super open to hearing them but that is going to do it for today thank you for watching i greatly appreciate it. any else where you want to leave on this series up to this point if you want more slay the spire on this channel let me know in the comments and with the form of likes and stuff like that it's absolutely how i judge whether or not i'm going to keep on running the series the views and views the comments the likes completely determines whether or not it's it's gonna stick around or not i like the series but if you guys don't like the series there's no point to do the series so thank you thank you see you next time